Now, the Board of Health meeting was supposed to address two issues, considering making mask requirement at certain places and extend the time in which there was a rule for people to self-isolate. MTN's Cody Boyer was also at the meeting and caught up with the Gallatin City County Health Officer afterwards. There were two major items on the docket today to be considered by the Gallatin City County Board of Health. One, a 90-day extension for the self-isolation rule during the COVID-19 pandemic that's been going on since the start. The second, wearing face masks like this one in public indoor spaces. You are this it makes me sad. We should be able to listen and talk to one another. There's no scientific evidence. The meeting that never started. Health Officer Matt Kelly alongside the other board members say the goal, limit the spread in the easiest way. Masks are inexpensive, they're safe, and there's something we wanted to give the community a chance to have a discussion today and have and let the board make a decision. And unfortunately, we were not able to get there because of the disruption at the meeting. The consideration, require face coverings in specific indoor settings with lots of foot traffic, bars, restaurants, government buildings, schools, and retail businesses. Consequences for violating that will be handled in civil court, according to law enforcement. The topic filled the auditorium with posters and angry voices. It's kind of the same principle as when you cover your sneeze or your cough. And you do that out of, of simple um, courtesy to your fellow human being. A thought that, if that means required masks, longtime Montanans like Scott Palmer disagree with. We have a right. I'm 66 years old, native Montana, born and raised in Montana, and I've never seen anything like I've seen today. The postponement gives the community another 48 hours to consider before the board returns to the topic virtually. But Kelly recognizes the frustration. They're not a silver bullet. They're not going to end the pandemic, but they can be an important factor. And hopes Friday will go differently. It would just be nice if we could have people listen as well as um, communicate their own ideas. In Gallatin County, Cody Boyer, MTN News. So as it stands right now, that meeting will take place 7 o'clock on Friday morning. It will be virtual only. You can find a link to join that meeting by visiting our website.